Hey you guys, it's your girl Gigi, and I was asked to do a reaction video to Eva LaRue being on Fuller House. Now I know a lot of you are probably like, who and what? So let me kind of bring it back a little bit for you. So, I had put out there on Twitter what kind of videos did you guys want to see me do and someone requested me to do reaction videos because apparently my reactions to things are hilarious to you guys. Don't really know why. Then, um, yesterday, I got a inbox on Instagram from a good friend of mine named Eddie. He's a good YouTube friend of mine. And he asked me if I would do a reaction to Eva LaRue being on Fuller House. So I'm gonna give you kind of a reaction to everything as a whole, because I kind of have to explain it. So Fuller House is supposed to be this spin-off of Full House that's set to premiere only on Netflix next year. Um, and Eva LaRue is playing, I think he said she was playing Danny Tanner's wife. I think that's what it said. Okay, my reaction to this, why, why, why to it all? Listen, listen, Full House was a part of my childhood. It wasn't my favorite show, but it's definitely a show I grew up watching. Why are you trying to relive that? First of all, let's talk about the people. It's going to have the original cast. They are all old and they all have like not done anything since Full House. That was a success. Aside from the Olsen twins. And John Stamos stays, you know, above water with his little Greek yogurt commercials. Is John Stamos really Greek? If not, he's milking that whole Greek thing. But yeah, anyway, we haven't seen Aunt Becky, we haven't seen Danny Tanner, we haven't seen Uncle Joey, and we all know they can't afford the Olsen Twins. Because apparently the Olsen Twins are worth $3 million. I don't know if that's together or if that's each, but either way you look at it, I highly doubt they can afford to hire the Olsen Twins. And if they choose to come back, they'll be coming back on their own accord. And now let's talk about the Eva LaRue aspect of it. What has she done since CSI Miami? As far as I'm concerned, this whole entire show is just, you know, everyone trying to revive a career because Netflix is the new cable. So I'm not really sure, okay, what the purpose of doing this is. Now, into the specific question of my reaction to Eva LaRue playing the wife of Danny Tanner. I just want to know, first of all, this is what Eva LaRue looks like. She's pretty, right? She, I mean, you know what? I'm gonna do a little comparison photo of how she looked back in the day to how she looked now. But either way you look at it, she's still very pretty. This is Danny Tanner. Do again, I'll do a comparison. This is then and now. Who, who, who is gonna believe that he was able to get her? Who gonna believe that? I don't believe that. I mean, give a thumbs up if you were surprised that he was even able to and Vicky. Y'all remember Vicky? You know, I'll tell you what I remember. I remember one particular episode of Full House where Danny had a problem with dating Vicky because Vicky was a year older than him. And it was like, you're lucky you got her. Like, don't have a problem. I'm sorry, Bob Saget. <laughs> Bob. 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 First of all, your name is Bob. Yeah. Yeah. Listen, I'm not trying to knock anybody's career. I mean, I get it. You all chose a career where, you know, money is probably few and far in between if you don't collect royalties on repeating episodes. But I just think that when they choose to remake things like this and and try to bring back a nostalgia that is just like long since gone. To me, it's a little bit crazy, a little bit sad. I'll, you know what? How about this? I'll watch the first episode when it premieres next year. If I remember, y'all gonna have to remind me because y'all know my memory. I will watch and I will do a review for you guys.
and let you know how I feel about it. I'll be fair, I'll give it that. Cause you know what, I did that with High School Musical. I looked at the previews, I knew I wasn't gonna like it. But I was like, let me give it the benefit of the doubt. No, I didn't like it. So I doubt I'm gonna like this Fuller House business. You know, but you know, whatever. So that's my reaction. Eddie, you wanted it, you got it. Um, as far as other reaction videos, let me know what you want me to react to and I will gladly put the video out there. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and share because sharing is caring. And I post videos whenever I feel like it. If you want to see what I like to post, click that subscribe button. It's free and it won't hurt. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.